Welcome back to the Plus Side of Nashville. We've been talking about theater group Actors Bridge Ensemble and their 20th anniversary season. My guest is co-founder and artistic director Valley Forster and girl participant Brayona Townsend. And we were talking about Act Like a Girl. And girl, by the way, is spelled G-R-R-L, <laughs> which I love. Um, it's, it's a wonderful way you're helping young teenage girls. It is a paid program, mm -hmm. but you offer scholarships. Yes, at least 50% of the girls wow. will attend on scholarship. Some years it's more than that, but yeah, yeah so, so there are many ways to get involved. I see. Well, as you celebrate your 20th anniversary this year, you've got a lot of, of, of performances in the second half of the season planned as world premieres, and Act Like a Girl is gonna be a part of that. Yes. Talk about that production. Okay. Well, during the month of June, 14 teenage girls are going to go off into the woods in Bonhoeff, <laughs> Tennessee and what? write their own performance piece oh, wow. to tell the stories of their lives. They will create original dances and original songs to go with that and we will come back to town and perform that at the end of June at the Belmont Black Box Theater totally a world premiere experience it's oh they are all such great writers uh -huh. and um, how many how many uh, girls do you have uh, in the program there'll be 14 this summer wow that's gonna be really something to see mm -hmm. have you already been thinking about it getting excited about it yes I'm always excited about coming back to act like a girl it's a really a surreal experience oh. like standing in front of a whole crowd of people yeah. speaking my truth and saying things that I never would have thought I would ever say, but it's something to really experience. Is that the goal? You, you, this is what you wanted for these young girls in yes. the valley. Yes, yes, to be able to articulate their values and their beliefs, and to say, stand strong in themselves, and say, "This is who I am. This is what I believe. This is what makes me me." Yeah, yeah. I think, and especially right at that teenage. In those teenage years, everybody is asking teenage girls to sit down and shut up. Uh -huh. And so uh -huh. I'm inviting them to stand up and speak out. <laughs> and I love that. they've got that. so much to say. And they really, they really, really do. do. Well, another uh, big component to your anniversary season um, is that a good friend of the show, Nate Epler, mm -hmm. has got a creative piece that he's going to be yes. a direct aid. Yes, he is directing the world premiere of his play, The Ice Treatment, in July. It opens on July 15th. Okay. And we're very excited. It was the hit of the Ingram New Works Lab at, at Nashville Rep last year and as soon as I saw it there I was like I have <laughs> to have the world premiere at Actors Bridge. So we're thrilled. It's going to star Rachel Agee who is a, a longtime company member at Actors Bridge and one of our one of our shining yeah. stars. So this is also going to be at Belmont Black Box Theater. Yes. Sitter? Okay. Yes. So that's two great performances you can't miss. Now some folks will be familiar with the size show ensemble that's a part of the Actors Bridge and every year for the last four years um, you've had the Sideshow Fringe Festival yes. and all kinds of interesting things go on at this festival. Yes, over a, over a four day weekend, Thursday to Sunday, the first weekend in August, we have over 50 acts. They are they're fringe acts because they're the kinds of things that would probably not be programmed in a traditional theater season. Aerialists and circus acts and fire eaters and one person shows and it's a great variety of entertainment and uh, and you can come and stay all day and see lots of different things at different venues that were, are within walking distance of each other. And so we will be over at our studio on Charlotte Avenue as well as at the Richland Park Library and um, oh, and wow. up and down the street there on Charlotte, as well as over at Belmont at the Black Box Theater. What exciting things. And when is it going to be the Sideshow Festival? What are the dates it of that? It opens on August the 4th, I believe, mm -hmm. and runs through the 7th. Okay. Um, and it is, it is a fun-filled weekend of magic. Something to look forward to come yes. August. Yes. Well, we're towards the end of the show here, but before we go, I, I just want to say I hope you'll be around 20 more years <laughs> Thank you. and uh, that you will continue doing what you're doing for this community bringing us those innovative mind you know make us think types of pro productions and working with our girls like Brianna 
<laughs> Thank you both so much Thank for being you. here. I wish Thank you nothing you. but the best of luck. Maybe someday we may even see you on Broadway. Who knows? She's getting an electrical engineering degree probably, but we never know where that could possibly lead you. So thank you both so much for being here. Thank, thank you. you. I want to also thank my earlier guest, Brandy Fenderson from the East Nashville Hope Exchange. And thank you for watching. I always appreciate it. I'm Tawanda Coleman, and I'll see you next time on the Plus Side of Nashville.